morning, good afternoon, good evening, depending on the part of the world that you're watching this video from. And welcome to my YouTube channel. Um, in this lesson, I'm going to be showing you how exactly you can uh, register a real account with XNES brokers. A lot of persons have actually been requesting this. Some are, you know, trying to find out uh, which broker can they, you know, register with to start up their forex journey. Now. Let me let me let me tell you this before I go ahead. This video is just for educational purpose to so do your own due diligence to ensure that you make the right decision. As um, we are not going to take responsibility for you know any mishap that you might experience along the line. However, I can always tell you that on this channel, we we'll always provide you with relevant information that we aid your finance uh, journey. Now, one of the brokers that you know a lot of persons have tested and they feel comfortable with is this xness we have a large number of other brokers of which they're also doing well but in this video i will show you how you can register and fund your real account with xness so the first thing you need to do is just you know go to your browser and uh, and type xness.com www.xness.com and once you are there you click on account so you see this particular page that you are seeing currently so then you can fill in your details so i'll do that right away and right away of course i'm a nigerian so i'll fill in my country fill in my email address my email address my email address then then um, I'll, I'll type in my password type in my password so that settles and then continue so you can see that um okay that email is already in existence because i've used it to register one account but let me use a different email so that you understand what i'm talking about and also ensure that you check this box i declare and confirm that i am not a citizen or resident of us for tax purposes if you don't check that uh, particular um, 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 checkbox you don't check it what it means is that you are either a citizen of us or you, you or you reside in us and they will charge you know tax at interval so let me change this email let me change it to a different email entirely so i'm going to click continue continue click continue so let's wait for it to finish loading because I'm using my personal device so I can afford to save my password on my device. Now I've created an account. Now the next thing I'll do is under this my account, click just give me just a moment. So under this account, click real, real account. So the please tell us about your your trading preference and experience. So we can adjust our service to Okay, so you can you can decide to you know to to do that. Just click OK. You select the letter age group. Which of the options? Select your age group. Which option best? Okay, so just what is your annual net income? You can decide to choose anything. So let's say let me just choose something. How much could you save from the net income after all expensive? So let's say, uh, let me just choose this. Just choose anything at random. This. Do you agree with this statement? I income will definitely improve my life. Yes, of course, yes. How much money do you plan to invest in trading? Okay, let's say $10,000. If you have more, you can pull that. What do you do for a living? Um... You can decide let me go for a self-employed what is your highest education degree okay so just you just check the one that suits you then click next click next click next now what is your trading experience okay real account if you have more than more than six months experience you can you can
Okay, just it's not important actually. Just check anything that you feel is appropriate. Then um, so which of these instruments do you trade the most? Okay, we trade gold, we trade cryptocurrencies, we trade currency pairs. So those are the basic ones I trade. What is your dominant trading style? Okay, I'm, I'm a scalper. Most of the time I scalp then on few occasions. Um, so I, I go I go I go with swing trading on swing on a few occasions. So I'm a scalper. So next. So how much time do you dedicate to trading per week? So let's say 12 or more hours. Of course, if you're a full-time trader, you need to dedicate more, you know, more time to trading. How long do you think it will take you to master trading skills? Okay, to master on average, it takes six months on average. So then you click next. What is your biggest fear in trading? Okay, biggest fear is, let's say, losing money. That's the biggest fear. Imagine that you are given a single opportunity to spend 10% of your monthly income on a favorite trade. Which would you choose? Okay, 10% of your monthly income. That means um, you, 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 have, you have the option of, okay, don't trade if you want to. You have the privilege. You can see the statement you have there of um, using 10% of your income on a favorite trip, favorable trip. So which of these options best suits what you may like to go for? The 90% chance of winning, 15% to your monthly income, six percent chance of winning, plus fifty percent to your monthly income. The five chance of winning plus hundred percent. Okay, let's let me just go for this. And next, decide morning. Why do you like trading? Okay, I want to be part. I like to challenge myself and sharpen my mind. I want to become okay. Or trading no. Okay, I want to be more independent from. All, okay, I think that that best. That's a very good one. So done, done. So now. Now, uh, my canal under this my account, click on real, click on real. And for me, I'm using MT5, so you can see this is MT5 account. But if I want to create a different account altogether under this same real, all I just need to do is um, click this setting icon. No, I beg your pardon, I beg your pardon, open your account rather, open your account. You can see open real account. You can see the under standard open real accounts, open real accounts. So you click open real accounts, open real accounts. Then you are open real account. Depending on the trading platform, if it's MT4, you choose MT4. If it's MT5, you choose MT5. I advise that you go with leverage as one to five hundred, one to five hundred. Then your currency is of course US dollars. Account nickname is not important standard. But for me, I prefer MT5 account because I use MT5 to trade. Some many builders prefer using MT4. So if you are opening MT4 trading account, click on MT4. But in my own case, I'm using MT5. So once that is done, once that is done, you create a password. Create a password. Create a password. Create a password. So once you create a password, you click create an account. Create an account. So and your account has been created. So you can see it. You can see it. This is a real MT5 account. I've created one before, so I have to create and download so that you understand how it is done generally. So this is another real MT5 account. So the next thing we'll do now is how do we fund this account? So you just click this drop down button that you can see you can see it so you, you want to once you click that um once you click that oh i beg your pardon if since i have two accounts so depending on the one i want to use but this is the one i just created now so just click deposit click deposit deposit let's wait for it to load click deposit so once you click deposit, you can see the options: online bank, bank transfer, bank card, uh, Bitcoin. We have a lot of options, so you can decide to use online bank transfer to make it easier for you. So please verify your profile to use this payment. So you then you verify your profile, verify your profile, verify your profile. So 
let's just wait for it to finish loading so if i provide so then there are a few more steps before you can deposit and trade so click send me code send me code so once once um, they send you code you need to log into your to your gmail so let me do that very quickly let me quickly log into my gmail let me quickly log into my gmail so gmail okay the mail is is in so if i check that mail let me click the mail if i check the mail just give me a few seconds we'll, we'll be right back if i check the mail it's still loading it's still loading it's still loading the network is very messy okay okay as you can see left so i can just copy the code copy the code copy the code and take it back to that particular page where you know it is required that i enter the code so i'll just paste it there I'll just paste it so that's the code so then click continue continue then how do you want then how do you want uh, how would you like to receive the code i prefer sms so you input your number zeros so that's my number that's my number then send me code send me code so wait for that code to drop once it drops then we are good to go i'm still waiting for the code yeah the code is here the code is here the code is here five eight four 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 seven so five eight four 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 seven then i'll click continue continue then i can now fill in my personal details my personal details first name last name gender gender then fill in fill in your your date of birth in your date of birth fill in your date of birth fill in your date of birth date of birth okay your address your address then click continue so you are all set then you can now click deposit now deposit now deposit now okay so deposit now i want to use online bank transfer for example so it's of course it's going to reflect in usd so I can just put the amount I want to deposit in Naira. You see the equivalence. So if I deposit ten thousand, I'll receive fourteen point three dollars. If I deposit hundred thousand, I'll receive one forty two dollars. So if if um, if I want to also know the equivalence in dollar, so all I just need to do is vary the amount, vary the amount I want to deposit. So since my um default currency is is hundred I mean is um, naira so you can say if I put seventy thousand seventy thousand you can see it's about hundred USD that's because at the stand now one USD is seven hundred dollars so so if I deposit you have hundred dollars then you click continue so once you click continue you click continue so once you click continues once you click continue you see the account details. You see account details where you are going to be transferring the, the cash. You are going to be transferring. You can see it. So online bank transfer. So once you click confirm, it will take you to you know, the page where you get the account details. I hope that help you. I'll please appeal to you that uh, you, uh, you like share and subscribe to this channel so that once i drop any video you'll be among the first set of people to get notified and i'll see you in the next lesson
Thank you.